I've tried knitting before, but I've been told that I'm not very good at it. So I'm going to try arm knitting. Uh, I don't know what it is. I'm just assuming you don't use needles, which I mean, why? yeah, cut out the middle man, am I right? I feel like these were the reason I did so bad uh, when I tried knitting, so. Hi, I'm Shandy of Expression Fiber Arts. So you want to use some kind of bulky yarn. This is Sari Ribbon Yarn. What? This is Sari I Chose Such Small Yarn. Just cinch it up and get the tail, just shove that out of the way. Okay, so we're gonna do a super simple cast on. So you take the working yarn in your left hand and give it a twist like so. Okay. <laughs> now what? Like that. What was and the then oh. insert your right hand into that loop you've just made. Yeah. And give it a little bit of a cinch. <laughs> Wait, did I do it? And then make another loop with your left hand. I have a loop right here. Twist the working yarn like so and pop it onto your wrist and give it a cinch. Am I supposed to have a bracelet? There's no way I messed up on step two, okay? And give it a cinch. You can cast on as many stitches as you like. I'm gonna do 10 for this project. So we'll speed things up and here we go. Why not? Okay, so we're done with that. No, we're not. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So much easier to count too. This is how it's meant to be, okay? How cave women used to do it. Grab the working yarn in your right hand, the same hand that you have all the stitches on. Grab the first loop and remove it from your hand. You slide it right off. Right off. So you're still holding that. The loop that you've just made goes onto your left wrist. That makes sense. And you wanna go ahead and cinch that up just like you did when you were putting the stitches on your right hand. So you've now knit your first stitch. So we do it again. Grab the working yarn. Hey, hey. Grab it with the hand. Pull, just slip it off. Just slip it off. Slip it off. Put it on. So what do I do with all this? What, all of this right here. What do I do with that? And with all the stitches on it. Grab it. The Yours don't look like, oh. Uh, hold on, I think I got it. Oh, now you want a cinch. Now, how do we actually start knitting? I would love so to So you know. grab the, the loop that you've just made, goes onto your left wrist. And this you want to go ahead and cinch that up just like you did when <laughs> you were putting this together. Now, something to keep in mind, if you do need to remove the stitches from your hand for any reason, um, you can just slide them off your wrist and this onto my slip knot. a pencil or this one stays a on. long sleeve. Take this one like this. Take the working yarn, which is now a part of all the other yarn working or not. Look what I make. A mess. You should have the same number of stitches on this wrist that you had on the other wrist. So, since I... I don't know how to count all this. Do I count it as one? Or ten? I have fifteen. I started with ten. How do I have more? I should have ten stitches on my left wrist. I should. It's reverse. What the heck am I doing? Go ahead and cinch that up. What? I got two cinches. Okay, then we do it again. Hold on, Expression Hold. Fiber Arts. There's no way. There's no way I made the Eiffel Tower with a straight... <laughs> How? I couldn't do this with a yo-yo when I was seven, but I can do this accidentally doing yarn? Wow. I don't know why I'm still going. I feel like if I just keep going, eventually it's just going to fix itself. Ow. The more I pull, it's like Chinese finger cuffs. I have Chinese finger cuffs on, or just handcuffs if you don't want to be racist. I started over three times, thrice, Expression Fiber. I have started over thrice, okay? I don't have it in me to do it again. Here we go. How did I do this? How did I make a tribal decorative bracelet on accident? There's, how? Ow, it's cutting off my circulation. Why? Is that what we were supposed to make? Here Just like you've been doing yeah. the whole time. I've been doing this. This is necessary so that your scarf doesn't unravel. This will lock all the stitches together, basically. I ain't worried about it's that. It's the same as when you're <laughs> I'm actually trying to get it to unravel. In the beginning of the video, she said it'd be about half an hour. Good party gift. It's been 45 minutes. It looks like something someone would be very disappointed to receive for their special day. 
I got you this for your birthday. Uh, the internet says it's a blanket. 